Is he's over here too? Is that him right there? I think I see him. He's right there. Oh man, that's freaking awesome. Hey, welcome back everybody. The Accidental Survivor here, and we're back with another episode of Scum. And I am on the outskirts of this major looking town right here. And we got to kind of pass through that in order to continue on down. Um, I should have taken this freaking dirt road and we could have stopped that. You know what? I may stop at the bunker anyway. There's a bunker right here and um, there's no mechs. So maybe we could check that out as well. Either way, we're working our way towards the naval base. We got our bike over here in the bushes. We'll go ahead and get that out. Still looking for a lock that I can throw on here. But in the meantime, we'll place it in stuff. We'll we'll put it in places such as the uh, bushes like that until we, uh, dude, go. <laughs> oh, I do remember this town. Um, you know, until we can find a lock or we don't have to leave it laying, you know, hiding it or whatever. I may still hide it even with a lock on there. Um, let's, um, you know, I think there's a police station here in this town. I think it's right over here to the right. Ooh, we could check that out maybe. Or there's, there's something like that over here in this area. Uh, let's just stroll through here quietly. And if we have to, we can speed away. I haven't seen any puppets yet. I should be checking all these items, though. Let me let me stop right here. We can always jump on top of this garage if it gets... Uh, some You know, this stuff gets out of hand, but at least I can check places like this. Let's get in here and close that door. All right. And what do we have in here? take a look around we got a uh, safety pin you know we did drop a lot of our now we've got a bunch of bobby pins we dropped a lot of our lock pick and stuff all the screwdrivers so let's see if we can find screwdrivers uh nylon line you know let me um let me take one of those i think we need that for something uh we don't need the bobby pin here a three of three screwdriver we'll go ahead and take that i'll put that right here if we find some more i'll go ahead and pick those up too we had to drop them all so we could make room in our inventory uh, last episode, you know, sell a lot of those a lot of those things to the trader uh, to get to, to get the money we needed to buy what we have. And uh, damn, we need more arrows. I got one freaking arrow. I don't see anything else in this little garage. Man, they all freaking spawned in. Damn it. Um, let me do this. There's a roadway over here, or is it over here? I think it's over here. We're going to have to roll past these puppets. And I want to see if there's a uh, police station here. In the meantime... Oh, crap. Yeah, that's a police station right here. Uh, let's see if I can lose these dudes. And jump up on a roof right here. I don't know if I can jump up on this roof. Hold up, dude. Hurry up. Oh, crap. Oh, boy. Okay, here we go. Oh, there's three of them. Okay, maybe I can take him out. Okay, um, there's one. We got a freaking riot control freaking cop. Come on. Man, this cleaver works awesome. Hope I don't screw it up and lose it. Somehow. <laughs> All right, let's check this guy out. Um, I'm not really going to be searching this whole town. Here's another screwdriver. Let's take that. We may, we may need it. Um, I'm mainly going to check out the police station. You know, the lockers that are here. We're not going to worry about all the little stuff that we may uh, find if we search the rest of this town. We want the good loot. And uh, we got to get in here. Oh, there's a pharmacy, too. All right, let's check the pharmacy first. Come on, man, get inside. Close those doors. Let's check inside here. Maybe we can find some antibiotics here. Uh, I mean, we don't need them right now, but like I said, I, I, I do want to keep my eye out for them. Hemostatic dressing and a crutch. Let's take the uh, bandage. We will take that. Our inventory is all super cleared out now because uh, of all the stuff we got right about the trader uh, to buy this new larger backpack, which I'm excited for. I mean, look how much space I got. That is so freaking awesome. It was worth it. It was worth it, I think. I mean, yeah, we could probably find one of these, but I hadn't found one yet. So, in the meantime, let's search all this place up. Uh, a bobby pin, no. No bandage. We don't want that. Nothing there. Let's see. Uh, oh, what is this? Painkillers. Um, you know what? Let me take them. 
I think I still have some of that stuff on me, stuff like that. I do have painkillers, but it's another blister pack. I'll take that, and uh, let's check the money. Yeah, we need we need to go start getting our money back. Uh, we got seven hundred bucks. Well, there's not one hundred and forty one. 141, that's, that's freaking, that's a lot, you know, to find in one spot. Um, another hemostatic dressing, let's take that as well. I said, if we need to, I can drop that stuff, but I'd rather have it right now. Find a lot of bandages, too. I like that. You know, last time we came in here, we found mostly face masks and stuff, you know, stuff like that. Not a lot of medical stuff. There's no puppets in here. More painkillers. I'm going to leave those. I don't know if the value... If those have a better value, you know, even with missing pills out of that blister pack, I just don't want to carry it on me. I already have some. I'll take the cheese. That's our food supply there. I hear freaking puppets outside. Another bandage. Let's drag that out and uh, put that here. Why are these separated? That's probably me. Me being stupid. All right. We already checked that one. We're almost ready to roll out of here. I hear puppets downstairs. Damn, another bandage. I wonder if they're trying to tell me something. Am I going to be needing these soon? They're going to give me a lot. Uh, no, no scissors. Still haven't found, you know, just like a, a, a blister pack of antibiotics. Ooh, oh, it's firefighter jacket. That's different from what I've got. Oh, I like that. I like the color. It's at 82%. Uh, let me equip that. Oh, it's the yellow version. Okay, you know, let's take that. Um, I, like, I like it. The red was kind of making me stand out. And the... Uh, I don't want the zombies seeing me, you know, with a red. <laughs> not that they would, but, you know, I just like this. I've never seen a yellow one like that, you know, not in this game. Uh, so let's let's move all this over there. I hear the freaking puppets outside. They could come running in here any minute. See, that's at 95%. That's at 82. Let's go and repair that really quick. We'll get that back up to 100. And now it kind of matches my helmet a little bit. My pants are off, but that's fine. Yeah, we're back to 100% on that. Uh, anything else need repair while we're here? Everything else is looking pretty good. Gloves look like they could be repaired, so we'll do that. And how's my shoes looking? Those are always the ones that are oh, 91. Basic engineering went up. Okay, awesome. That'll help. Do stuff like that. Okay, let me get the cleaver back out. And uh, let's go see what that puppet down here making noise was. Okay, there's one right there. Is it just him? Let me let me take this guy out. I just don't want him coming in behind me when I'm over there trying to open a door up. Okay. No screaming. Well, here another one. There's one like right inside the building here. Let's get this one because he's gonna be he's gonna be waking up when I uh when I start open opening lockers. What the hell? Oh my god, dude! They're all coming. No, no, no. No. Get him off the door. They're busting both doors open. Hold on. All right. We got to freaking go. We got to freaking go. Where can we go? On top of this garage. Crap. Dude, get on the freaking wall. Oh, I jumped over the wall. Are you kidding me? Son of a... Dude, I couldn't get off the wall. All right. We're going this way. Get over here. Let's go around the corner. Oh my gosh. They all freaking came out. There's my bike. Maybe they stopped chasing me and they're over here. Let me slow down a little bit. Where did they go? I'm going back to the police station. <laughs> oh, there's one here. All right, we'll take care of him. Oh no, they're all here. Crap, they came back. Get him. Ah. Okay, we got to get some of these knocked down. Okay, we got we got a couple. Okay, we got him. Here comes another one. Come on. Hit him. Dude, I can't freaking hit him. Come on. You got to be kidding me. Go, go, go. My guy's not moving. I got no stamina. Come on. Okay, okay. I think we got him. My stamina is freaking done. Oh, my gosh. All right, we took like four of them out. What's my health looking like? Uh, I should do this inside, but I'm going to check real quick. Okay, I'm bleeding injury. Let's eat. I'm bleeding injury, which will go down. I do have an uh, infection, 
but we're going to eat that, and that should get rid of the uh, bleeding injury. Okay, it did. I'm not even going to check these dudes. We're just going to go. We're going to hurry up and get this done. Otherwise, I'm going to be over here and get freaking trapped or something. Uh, let's get the cleaver back out. Dude, I didn't know they all came back over here. Um, oh, what the hell? Why is my health blinking? Okay, bleeding injury. Um, okay, I got it. My health is down to 72, but it's not all the way down. I mean, it's not dropping still. Um, holy crap. All right, now that we're in here, let's take a look real quick. Just calm down. We got this under control. Let's go ahead and repair this jacket. I already freaking got it all torn up already. So my stomach is empty, bleeding injury. All right, we're going to eat and do all that stuff here before we roll out. I just wanted to get that ammo, and uh, we did eat the garlic. Where did it go? We have two left of five, and I think we have another garlic. on. Ooh, that's the only garlic we have. All right, let's eat all of this. Little cheesecake or slice of, <laughs> slice of cheese and cheesecake. Um, man, I'm still freaking in, um, infected. But, I mean, that'll... Okay, I'm, I'm going to take another garlic once this is done here. Uh, let's eat another one. Okay, there's more garlic. All right, the the, the infection is gone. Um, that's going to take a while to, to heal up. Okay, let's put that away. Uh, we've got one piece of garlic left. The rest of them are in my... Oh, man. The rest of my garlic is in the chest back way back to the north. So, um, in the meantime, let's go ahead and uh, see if we can pick some of these locks to get to make it worthwhile, you know, while we're here. Uh, okay, we got a Peacekeeper 38. We'll take that, and we'll take some more 9 mil rounds. We can, uh, I think we can stack those right there. No, we can't. What is this? Oh, that's 45 rounds. That's why. Uh, there's 9 mil right there. We can stack these, I believe. 30, and oh, we got 16 more. All right. That's fine. We got that one locker open. Let's uh, try this one. All right. We got two screwdrivers left, so we can get these last two lockers, and that's going to be about it. Another, a Viper. I'll say another one, but we got a Viper. We got three different guns. Uh, the bird shot, I'm going to leave here. Okay, we only got two screwdrivers left, so we got to be, you know, on point getting these locks picked. HSF-19. <laughs> Dude, we got all these freaking different pistols. Uh, Deagle 357 magazine. We'll hold on to that. Again, I may drop this stuff if I need to. This is my last lock pick, or my last screwdriver, I should say. Come on, we got to get this. There we go. That's it. Peacekeeper 38. That's the same one as this one. That's at 70%. This is at 78. Let's go ahead and swap them. Just a little bit better. And some more 45 rounds. I hear I hear puppets outside walking around. Uh, let's check these lockers while we're here. Military goggles. Uh, what am I wearing? I was wearing these. Sunglasses. Yeah, let's take the military goggles. And, oh, we got some more magazines here. Let's take these as well, since we're here, and we have a little bit of space. But we're going to take our cleaver back, and uh, we'll check these little boxes here. Ooh, four more shotgun shells. Let's put that in uh, with the other ones. I hate that I, you got to put them there first, but that's fine. You don't have to do that with the money, but uh, I get it. Seven more rounds. Okay, we'll take those two, and we'll put them here and stack them. 15 rounds. All we need now is our shotgun back, which we left back also at our base. Here's a lock. Uh, I'm not going to take that. I'm going to keep my eye out for one of those other locks that I could just slap on the vehicle right away. Uh, hold on. My thirst is low. Before we head out there, let's get a quick drink. Do I have anything like a soda can that I can get rid of? I don't think so. I've got uh, this bottle of water here. We'll take, we'll take a few drinks out of this. Let's do another one. Now, I do have my rifle, and what does this take? Can I reload this one yet? I cannot. No, we don't have the ammo for that one. That's right. Okay, let's get the uh, cleaver back out. Let's see if we can get on our bike and just get the hell out of here. I don't know where all the puppets that chased me went to. I, th I don't think that was them. Yeah, let's get, let's get the hell out of this town. We got what we came for, which was uh, a chance to check out that police station. And we used up all the screwdrivers that we found 
in this town, and we'll keep an eye out for those uh, for more of those as well. And now we are heading straight down that road that I wanted to to get us down towards the naval base. So, uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and roll on, and unless something happens, I'll see you when we get uh, to the next point of interest. Hmm. All right, we got a little tiny little village here. There's not much. I don't see any puppets, but I do see a car. So let me get out here. Hopefully there's no puppets here. Let's get the cleaver out just in case. They may pop in later. Uh, we do have a vehicle here. Oh, not open like that, dude. Stop. Damn it. It's not what I meant to do. I meant to do this. And just look on the inside. I wish I could claim one of these vehicles and not have everybody mess with it. You know, that way I can put some <laughs> unload some of my stuff into there. Um, but, you know, we can't do that really. The only thing I could really do... Some cherry seeds. What is this? Garlic seeds and industrial fertilizer. The only thing I can really do is build like another wooden chest and kind of like put it down near the naval yard and I can throw a bunch of stuff in there and maybe get it when I come back out. I don't know. But I, I mean, if I don't have the room on me, on myself, I mean, there's not much I can do. I'd like to be able to see if I can figure out the storage thing for the bike. And I was told you can build one. You know, matter of fact, we should do that here. While there's no puppets around, we're in the middle of the road. Let me look at this, the crafting really quick, and uh, let's look at just storage. Uh, what is this? Improvised stab-proof vest. See, I'm not really sure what that would be under. A bag? Is it maybe it's under bag? All right. I, I, can't, I can't find anything that would let me craft a storage thing for the bike, so we're going to just roll on out and... Uh, yeah, we're just going to keep going. Uh, maybe maybe uh, I can figure that out later or somebody will leave me a clue. What the hell? Oh, there's puppets right there. You know, what What I need to do to craft that, even if that's if that's even an option. But uh, I heard it was that you can put a bag on the bike. It doesn't hold much, but you can do something. And I always wanted to try it out. But if not, you know, no problem. We'll, we'll keep going until we find something else. All right, it looks like we have another intersection coming up. We're not going down that way. That'll take us toward the coast, but we're, we're going to stay on this path. This will take us uh, down the yellow way toward, right to the naval base. And we have another little house here with another car. It looks like the last place I just passed. Same setup, <laughs> except they don't have that little tower. All right, I'm not going to check that place out. I don't see there being anything in there. You know, maybe a bag of fertilizer or something like that, but that's about it. All right, let's keep going. Oh, boy. Okay. We are coming up to the front gates of the naval base. Oh, there's a freaking puppet right there. Crap, please don't see me. No, dude. I was going to park my bike here. And I can't freaking get off. All right. I was going to go around the, this side because I want to see if I can find a boat that I can put stuff in, lock up, hide, you know, all that stuff. But we got to get away from that freaking puppet first. So let's, let's go around here. There's no mechs. So I should be safe from, you know, but there's going to be tons of puppets. That's the problem. Uh, let's go put my bike over here by this, uh, tower. We're going to put it right here by these bushes. All right, that's where we got to come back to, uh, get our bike. It's right here by this corner. The, the set of bushes right there. All right, now before we go inside this place, and I do want to go inside very badly, <laughs> let me look over here and look over the edge of this, uh, cliff to see if there's any boats down by this dock. Because I know that's one of the spawn locations for boats. Is uh, that dock over there? Maybe down along here. And I'm not seeing any, but let's get a little bit closer, just in case I hadn't spawned in yet. Because if I can find one here, I'll keep a lookout for a, a lock and put it on. I don't see any boats. All right. Okay. Uh, let me slow down a little bit. We don't want to be out of stamina. I wish I had, um, you know, a way to get some of these items out. We're gonna go in there and see what we can find. If I have to, I'll throw some of these items on the ground. Uh, but I would like to get some more arrows made just in case we got puppets that we're going to have to deal with. So, uh, let's get out. I don't like using my cleaver. It's at 58%. Dude. All right. got to have to find, um, do I have any other blade on me that I can use for chopping? Let's get a stone knife. I don't want to mess up my, um, yeah, I don't want to mess up my stuff crafting. What if, it's too bad you can't hit here and like click on like recipes and it tells you what you can make out of that item. So let's see, uh, stone knife. No? What the hell? Tools and miscellaneous. Oh, that's because I'm on tools. Let's go up. Let's go here. There we go. Stone knife. Yeah, just to make it a little easier. I could right click, 
click, kind of like Seven Days to Die, where if I click on it, it'll give me a whole list of all the recipes that that item would go with. And, uh, and there we go. We got our stone knife. We're going to take that into our hands as soon as I get out of that inventory. And now we can use this. Search. Oh, you can use this to chop. Uh... Oh, well, let me cut that down either. Oh, I see. You got to hold it down. They changed that. That's different. Okay, let's uh, let's go back. Let me get that out of my hands. I had to hold down. Okay, I got it now. Used to be I just pressed F like that, and it would start cutting. Now you have to hold down F, and then the, it'll give you a, a series of actions. So I would say cut. Dude, what the hell? There we go. Man, this thing is freaking weird. It was not working. It was like it, I pressed F, and it wouldn't do anything. And then when I held F, it didn't do anything. But we got that. At least now I can take here and cut into small sticks without having to click on any other weird thing. We're just going to make a couple arrows. And I don't have any feathers, so we're not going to make any arrows with the... Uh, we're not going to make the better arrows, I should say. I just don't have the place for them. These are wooden arrow feathers. We're going to actually drop that. And we're going to make uh, a bunch of smaller ones so we can carry more. All right. Now, wooden arrow stone... Let's just try arrow, wooden arrow, and we're going to craft, we're going to auto-craft all of them. All right. That's the feather one. Let's get all the ones with the arrow, or the wooden ones. I sound like, I, I think I just heard a freaking puppet. Hold on. Let's get these back in here. No, get out of there. Oh my gosh, dude, stop. I swear I heard a puppet. I heard that little puppet growl. They sometimes spawn in, you know, like, after I arrive on scene. Just like I did at the last town. There was, like, nobody around. I got off the bike, came out of the garage, and there was, like, three puppets there. Anyway, we don't really need to go this way because uh, there's no mechs, so I'm not really hiding from them. I'm just going that way because I wanted to see if there was a boat down there. There's a freaking puppet here already. He's a military one, too. All right, let's, um, let's go ahead and try to see what we can take him out with our arrows. That's why we just made all these. I missed them already. Missed them again. Oh, here he comes. Okay, got him in a leg. Got him again. Crap. All right, let's get the uh, cleaver out. Oh, damn you. Freaking got a hidden, hidden on me anyway. I'm probably bleeding too. It seems like every every time they even bump me, my guy's, like, bleeding profusely. Uh, let's take the wooden arrows back. We've got three left. <laughs> oh, my gosh. All right. And we had, like, seven. He's got a screwdriver. You know, let me take a screwdriver. We may come across. I'm going to get rid of this. Uh, and I'll, I can hold on to it. Um, come on, man. We may come across some lockers in here, and I want to be able to unlock them if, uh, if we can. We may need a screwdriver for that. Let me see if there's any arrows on the ground. I kind of shot right in this general direction. Okay, there's one. So we're back to four. Five, six. Okay, seven. All right, we got all our arrows back. And there's another freaking puppet. All right, this is Max Puppet, so I guess I'm expecting that. But at least there's no mechs. And if we could take these dudes out kind of like this. Oh, I keep freaking missing. There we go. Crap. All right. Nope. Oh, man. Thought he was going to freaking connect. All right. Well, that's another puppet out of the way. There's probably another four in the way. <laughs> probably another four up here ahead before I get to uh, the place I want to. Let's creep up a little bit. Where'd that arrow go? I just saw an arrow. I saw another one. Dude, where the hell my arrow go? All right. Let's, let's get out of there. Stand up. What did I say? Oh, search for rocks. Dude, where is my... I had two arrows in them. All right, I guess we lost an arrow. But we can look up here again, see if we can get another one or two back. Should be... There should be one on the ground up here. There's one. Okay. Okay, we're five. We're, we're missing two. Oh, and there's another puppet. Dude. Okay, th these are military ones. We're going to take care of this guy, too. Or try to. Oh, there's him. 
All right, awesome. Let's get the cleaver back out just in case. And there's my three arrows. Get them back. Still got five arrows. We're still missing two. We sh I, I'm going to make some more. I want to get like 12. But let's see what this guy's got on him. Uh, he's got one dollar. <laughs> I'll take it. Everyone helps. Yeah. And, uh, and we're not going to take anything else. All right, let's get the... Um, man, a cleaver's at 57%. Uh, let me take that stone knife into my hands. Let's see if we can make some more arrows really quick. Cut. Dude, cut this freaking butt. There we go. I guess you got to be closer to it in order for it to work. Maybe that's what the problem was. Any other puppets around? All right, let's make all of these into arrows. All right, those are all done. Let's pick all these up. We've got 12 arrows. Perfect. Let's get our cleaver back out. Let's move up closer to this uh, naval bar. Uh, naval bar. <laughs> naval yard. Okay, I see the hatch. There's one of the hatches right here. I kind of want to check the outside out because I've not really done that too much, but I'm worried there's going to be beepers on the outside. And it may be better off if I go into here, climb down, and look around on the inside. So let's try that. This is going to be a long freaking drop if I get this wrong. All right, and it's going to be dark down here. I hope not. I hope I'll be able to at least see a little bit once we get down near the bottom. Are you kidding me? I can already hear a freaking beeper giggling. I guess worst case scenario, I can always run back to the ladder and try to climb up it. Where is that coming from, though? Let's look around. There's no mechs for me to worry about, so I can actually take a look around what's going on. Who's beeping? Oh, he's down there. Can I get him with my bow? No, not the freaking... Oh, my God. No, no, no. Can't do it through this freaking fence. Oh, yes, we got him. That's freaking awesome. There's at least more, though. There's more, or at least one more, I should say. Is he's over here, too? Is that him right there? I think I see him. He's right there. Oh, man, that's freaking awesome. I'm like a crack shot now. <laughs> what if I can get my arrows back? No, I'm kidding. All right, let me look at this place now. This place is damn huge. I've never been able to get to anywhere near here. Okay, there's a puppet right there. I'm not going to shoot the ones up here. What is that jumping in the water? Did a puppet go in there? What the hell is... Why is it water bubbling? I don't know, but we're up top, and we can check this place out. I'm afraid... There's another pup. Oh, there's another one. Okay, let me get that beeper there. No. Crap, I hope they can't get up here. Okay, we got him. Please tell me they can't get up here. There's a lot of them. Look at them all. Oh, they're going into the water. Hell yeah, they're all going to drown. Yeah, get in that water, dude. Jump over here. Come get me. I woke them all up. I took out three beepers. I'm glad I'm not out down there on the ground. Yeah, jump over to water, dude. Come on. Oh, they're right there. In the f That's awesome. They're in the submarine pens. I think they can drown in the water if they jump in there. I know they can't get out. So th that's awesome. We got like three of them to jump in there at least that I saw. Oh, there's one guy here on the sub. You know what? That's fine. Because if he... Let me go over here. Maybe he'll jump off the sub and into the water. Yep, right in the friggin' water. <laughs> Another beeper. Dude, I'm glad I got a bunch of arrows. That was three of them. I don't even know if there's a stairway up here that they can get to. I was going to go over here, but I'm afraid to drop down. Just in case I can't get back up and or I land down below. There's a puppet there. There's another beeper right there. I think that's one right there. Maybe not. Okay, he heard me. All right, let's bring you down this way, dude. I want you to jump into the water. 
Where are you at? Come on, get over here. There's more stairs going up if I need to use them. Uh, the stairs right here. I'll go up this way if they come over here. I mean, if they get up top. Although I do, I do want to get down. I want to get down to the bottom, and I don't want to go back too far just in case the beeper comes back. You know that I've already the ones that I've already taken out. Let's get over this side, and we'll go down this way. What the hell? Is he up top? I think I'm safe up here. Yeah, let's go over this way. And um, there should be a set of, another set of stairs going down. Or a ladder going down over here. I, I can't see the freaking ground. I'm always wor I'm worried I'm going to like fall through. You know, there's going to be like a hole like this that I'm not going to see and drop straight down. All right, let's see if we can get on this ladder. I can't. I can't. There it is. I'm, I'm terrified that I'm not going to freaking... There we go. Okay, we're going down. Who's left? I don't see any puppets. I think they're all in the water. Maybe that's the bubbles I'm seeing. Maybe there's puppets down there. <laughs> um, okay, well, let's get down right here. I'm not even going to attempt to get too close. If there's puppets down there, they're probably dead. Um, or if they're not, they're alive, but they're at the bottom of the freaking water. Okay, we had a puppet down here. Or a beeper. Look at my, I got my arrows. They're almost broken, though. We got seven. How do I get my thing back? Let me, let me get my cleaver. All right, I'm just going to be cautious because I don't know if there's other beepers. What's all those red lights? Why they're all... See, there's an arrow going there. That's the exit. Let's go over this side. I've never been able to explore this just because I've been, the you know, the they had mechs just walking back and forth through here. Okay, there's a beeper over here. I don't think I'm too close to him yet, though. So I should be okay. There's a puppet over there. I'm trying to see if there's anything else I can climb on if I need to. I'll run back and go up a ladder or something if it's possible. I want to get in here and search these crates. Okay, there's two puppets there. Dude, get your freaking bow. Oh, you could kid me. Crap, he heard me. I think he did. Dude, what the hell are you doing? Oh my god, I couldn't get the freaking weapon out in time. Sitting there screwing around. It's like he wouldn't... My guy wouldn't, like, freaking pull the arrow back. Is he dead? Oh, he is. Alright, we can search him. Uh, wait, wait, what is that? 12 gauge. Let's take that. Oh, man, this thing is damaged. Let me repair this shirt really quick. I don't want to lose anything. I think we can do it quickly. All right, inventory. Stand up. Get the cleaver. All right, now maybe we can search some of these items here. Like this. No, I don't want a freaking rag. Uh, let me check my health really quick. Okay, I'm not injured. I mean, I'm not infected. We got to be careful about that, too. Underpants. <laughs> I got some, uh, some revealing underpants. Uh, I'm not going to take that magazine. We're going to be a little bit picky. Gas can, no. I just want to see what's here. I want to get in here and look around. Look at all this stuff in here. Oh, we got 147? Definitely take that. Uh, blue hard hat. We're not going to take that one. I like the yellow one. Dude, I thought I heard another puppet. Now, they could they could respawn while I'm here. Uh, look at that, a 33, a 40 screwdriver. Hell yes. All right, we don't need those little screwdrivers now. We can take that one. That's a good find right there. Uh, bar of soap. Construction gloves. Woodcutter shirt. A lot of crates. Oh, there we go. Repair kit. Maybe I can repair my uh, cleaver. Let me see if that's possible. Um, I need. I think I need a workbench. We're going to hold on to that. Maybe we can come across a workbench down here. And then I can repair uh, my cleaver so it doesn't get below 50. 
Uh, we're not going to take. We're not going to take that stuff. We got the good screwdriver. Yeah, we're not going to take them. I would. I would take them if I didn't have that one. Waste bag. Um, there's another puppet nearby. I got to be careful. Electrician's tools, scalpel. That's that's electrician tool. That's a good find too. I just not something I need at the moment. Wait, what was that ammo? Twenty-two tracer. Yeah, we're looking for the three hundred eight. If we can find that stuff, there's another repair kit. Or another tool kit, right there. Thirty-seven. This is a thirty-eight. Let me take. Oh man, look at that! A freaking sharpening, a grinding stone. Ooh, I wonder if I can do this now. Repair. I think I'm using the grinding stone for that. You know, not the uh, tool kits. Yep, it's down to 54. Okay, my, got my cleaver back to uh, 100%. Okay, awesome. You know what we're going to do, though? Uh, we I can't take all these repair kits or tool kits. I'll take one, but I'm not going to fill my inventory up with that stuff. Uh, let's see if we can get this, dude. I'm thirsty. Oh, come on. Oh, I got him in the head. I thought I, I, I thought I literally aimed way too high and it hit him right in the freaking head. <laughs> okay. Uh, ooh, what is that? Military quiver. What was I using? The bedroll. Dude, I got a military quiver now. Okay, let's put that in here. And let's put this in here. And where's my arrows? We're going to put them in here. Okay, we found a military quiver. That's definitely a good find. Something. Oh, here's a... Okay, this I don't really need. Uh, but let me see now. Can I repair? I don't really need to repair anything else. The, the cleaver, I thought I needed a... Um, oh, what is that? Desert Eagle. Oh, boy. Uh, okay, let's... Um, Peacekeeper 38. Viper. Let's get the Peacekeeper out. Let's take the Desert Eagle. Because we do have a Desert Eagle magazine, but that's 357. We don't have any 357 rounds, I don't believe. 45. 45, yeah, we don't have any 357 rounds. 9 mil. If we find a magazine for that uh, HSF-19, whatever it is, you know, I'll, I can load that up. This place is so huge. I mean, I could probably be here for, like, a long time. Car, there's a car repair kit. That was one of my arrows. Okay, I'll take that back. All right, I'm finding some good stuff here. That's why I wanted to go to places like this. Motorcycle mask. Oh, okay, I, I said motorcycle mask. I thought it was a bag. I was like, I got the bike bag. <laughs> uh, I'd really like to find a boat, though. Because with the boat, like I said, I can I can go put storage in it and drive around. I just hate dealing with that freaking... The wind and the rain. No, 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 no. I woke somebody up. Let's go back this way. Yeah, let's go over here. We're getting a little far away from where we came in. Probably areas where there's still puppets that I haven't taken care of yet. Uh, let's go down this way. <laughs> we got that beeper over here. I don't know where he's at. He sounds like he may be up in that room right there. Let's, let's see if we can check the train here. Uh, camouflage jacket. That beeper's making me nervous. I can't be here. What the hell? Somebody just make a, somebody just hit something. Like they're trying to break a door down. Let me go look over here. Let's see if I can get a visual maybe. There he is. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh, no. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Was it just him? Is it going to attract any other people around? Let's get out of the way. Oh, it's all lit up over there. That's like a way out. Okay, I don't see anybody running over this way. Oh, I should go that way. Take me back outside. Let's get up here. I don't know where the other beeper is, but maybe I can get my arrows. 
Yeah, ain't much left of him. There's an arrow. Okay, we got one back. That's probably the one that missed. What is that? Oh, it's HSF-19. There's, there's the magazine for that pistol. Okay, we do have a pistol we can use. I can't I can't be over here with this freaking beeper making noises. He's probably on the other side of this wall, but it's making me nervous. Let's get back down. I want to go that way. I don't know where that beeper is, though. It sounds like he's right around that corner. Like, it's kind of like that guy was on that corner. It sounds like there's one on that corner, too. Let's, um... Let's go back down here. We'll work our way over this way. We'll see if we can get back outside. Let me slow down, though. I gotta keep my stamina. In case I need to run. Oh, dude, there's one right here. Oh, crap. I got the cleaver, right? Yeah. What are you doing up top there, dude? Okay, he's down. All right. I don't want him screaming or doing... I mean, if one of these puppets down here screamed, I would be screwed because there's all kinds of puppets in here. Uh, three shotgun slugs. Kind of beat up, but I'll take it. Okay, can we look over here now? See, I'm worried there's a, a beeper like right over here. I thought I saw the outside. It's a tunnel. I don't know, man. I'm nervous. Where's that beeper? Where's the one I heard giggling? Can I get up on top of here if I need to? No. Damn it. Let's climb up here. Oh, wait. Hold on. I don't know about this, man. There's a big freaking tunnel. There's a beeper right there. Oh, my gosh. Oh my god, that was awesome. Get my arrow back. Let's get out of that stance. Alright, we took care of him. But there's another one. I see him right there. He's like limping or something. Or is that a regular puppet? I think that's a regular puppet. But there's another one down here. Dude, how many beepers are freaking in this place? There's another puppet there. We're not going that way. I see too many puppets. Alright, let's go back up to the surface. We're going to go up uh, over this way. There's a ladder over here. Let's just run down to the end. Get up on that ladder. Actually, I wonder if I can... Oh, no, I can't go out the... I don't think I can go out the end of this place and then up. I'll take a look real quick. I just don't... I don't think there's walls will allow me. I got to come in here like in a boat. But let's take a look really quick. Yeah, that's it. Um, if I jumped in here even though the shore is right there I'd probably sink like a stone right to the freaking bottom and then uh, I would be dead before I can make it over there so let's go up this ladder right here we'll go back up to the surface put that away yeah at least that way if a beeper came running at me I'd have some place to climb because they don't really climb ladders which is awesome now I gotta make sure I don't it's, it's always tricky getting off these freaking ladders I'm like gonna drop straight down to the surface okay there we go all right, we're back up top here, and now we got to get up this other ladder. And that'll take us all the way to the top. And I think there's a... This is a different way than what I came down, so there's another pat or hatch I'll need to open up. All right, it looks like the hatch is closed. I uh, should be able to open it, though, from, in, from inside. Oh, there ain't any puppets up here. There's one right there. Let's take care of him. Oh, there's two of them. All right, well, she's out of the way. Damn you. Okay. What the hell did he do to me? Okay, bleeding injury, of course. I'm not infected. Sounds like there's another puppet nearby, too. There it is, right there. Damn it. Um, okay. 
Let me just get up top so I can take a look around. All right, I think it's just him. Let's go over here. I want to get down below where I was, but on the on the outside, and see if I can uh, find a boat along the outside of these docks. All right. Okay, we got them. Sound like it always sounds like they're screaming. You know when they do that one little zombie howl. Um, okay. Still a dangerous place. This is a really dangerous place, even with no mechs. There's so many puppets. So many beepers. Oh, my gosh. And trying to take them out with arrows is tough. You know, the beepers. But let's get down to the dock. Like I said, there's no mechs. Uh, but I don't want to walk into, like, four puppets and have one of them scream. Okay. It's weird that I still have to sneak in, kind of like I did when the mechs were here, just because I'm look I'm on the lookout for puppets, you know, for the same reason. But at least the mechs, you know, with the mechs gone, I'm not dying, and you know, they're not gonna hit me twice and I'll be dead, or once. Um, we're gonna avoid this place for now. It's probably loaded with puppets, you know, right over there, these buildings, and we're gonna go straight down here to the docks. There's a lot I want to check out, though. I'm, I'm just... It's awesome to be able to come in here now and just look around like this. Or at least I'm saying that now until um, something happens and I get swarmed. Then I'm not going to be... Then I'm going to be like, that was a stupid idea. <laughs> but having to come back here to get my body, I'm not really wanting to do something like that. Um, okay, so we got the docks here. I'm not... I've not seen any of the boats. We'll keep an eye out for that. We're going to work our way over this way. A lot of There's a lot of crates and stuff. I know there's puppets down there. I probably just can't see them from here. Or they may not have rendered in. Let's get it. Oh, here's the entrance to the uh, the bunker. You know, this the underground naval base is right here, right below me, where there'll be mechs walking back and forth. Uh, now there's not, but we can look around now and see if there's any boats. It may be, like, further out. Um, you know, like on near the end of the docks, if there's a boat spawn, I'm not really sure. I've not really spent too much time out here just, just wandering around because, you know, the mechs have prevented me from doing that. So I'm not sure where there's like, where there are spawn points for boats and stuff like that. I hear a puppet. Okay. There's one up on top of the hill. There's one right there. See, they're loading in around me. They weren't there two seconds ago. Yeah. There's one right there. There's one there. Oh, dude. Okay. Let's go back this way. All right. Let's go down. Let's go check this building in this area out down here. We'll get down the rocks over here. And if there's puppets on this side, we'll take care of them over here. There we go. But this way we can check these buildings out. And there's some crates and stuff. There's a hole in the wall, but I don't feel like jumping into the water. Might as well, like, that's like committing suicide right there. All right, let's go check these little guardhouses out, see if there's anything up here. There's a freaking pistol. And a throwing star, M1911. I got one here. That's 98, 79. All right, we're going to leave that alone. Instead, let's go down the stairs. Down here. Yeah, we got all these crates now we can check. There's military goggles. Let me equip those. I like those better than these. Oh, we got a cooking grill. I didn't even see that. Gla uh, gas lantern matches. Okay, there's a puppet there. There's a military shirt. What am I wearing? Police shirt. Let me try it. Let me equip that one. What's the percentage of this one? 99%. Okay, what's in here? Let's put these into the military shirt. It's the same amount of space. I just think it's a better... It's better than the police shirt, in my opinion. I don't know. 50 BMG ammunition box. What the hell? What the hell was that? I heard... And an explosion. I want to get that ammo. Dude, what the hell was that noise? Did a did a beeper blow up? 
or has something happened that's going to make life really difficult for me here in a few seconds. Damn it. Let me see if I get this ammo. Oh, look how big the box is. Holy crap. All right, maybe we can sell it. If I ever make it out of here. Or, you know, I don't, you know, let me take that. I can't help it. They may be worth some money. And if I get, um, if I get a boat, I can sail back in here at any time and just like loot, loot crates like this. I wonder, oh, man, I thought this was a, uh, one of those cargo drop freaking cargo things. I want to go inside this building too, but I want to make sure there's no puppets around. Especially after hearing that explosion. Okay, we got four lockpicks. Let's take these. A lot of good stuff in here. A little beanie. Um, I'm not going to even take the magazines unless it's for a gun that I have. Tactical gloves. What am I wearing? I am wearing ta no. I'm wearing tactical gloves. What are, what did I have here? Police gloves. All right, we're gonna swap my gloves out. Hunter eighty five. What is that fire? Carbon hunter. Let me see. Let me let me swap them really quick. Let's see control. Fires twenty two rounds. Hmm. Um. You know I'm gonna. Yeah, it's loaded with 30 out 6 bullets, and this is 22. 22 rounds are a lot easier to find, I believe. I'm going to stick with the uh, the new one that I just found and leave the Carbon Hunter there, because at least the other one, if I find... Look okay, at antibiotics. Look at that. Oh, hell yeah. I'm sitting there searching clinics. I should have just come to the Navy base. <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, I'm searching around for uh, that specific ammo, and I can't buy it yet. But the 22 rounds are a lot more common, so I think we're going to go with that. All right, let's check this building right here. Nobody in here? No, what caused that explosion? Okay, we got a here ball cap or a baseball cap. All right, we got duct tape. Don't want that. Don't need that stuff. Another grill. Are they trying to tell me something? Couple more lock picks. We'll take those. I mean, our inventory is still pretty open. You know, I mean, it's not really open, open, but I mean, I've got a little bit of room. I probably could have squeezed that rifle in here, but I mean, maybe I should go pick that back up and put it in my inventory until I really need to drop something. Because there's not really anything in this building here. Yeah, let's go do that. But I'm thinking about wrapping this episode up right over here. Uh, there's the entrance to the uh, inside, which we were in earlier. Uh, so let me do this. If I take that 50 BMG ammo, let's put this over here. We take this gun. I can almost get it in here if I move these. There we go. All right, so we were able to grab that weapon. Um, that way, maybe maybe we'll find 308 round or 306 rounds, and then I can drop the other one. <laughs> Whichever one we find ammo for first, we'll get rid of the other one. But uh, I think I'm going to wrap it up right inside of here. I do want to thank you for taking the time to watch. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next week. Oh, there's one right here. Crap. What's up, dude? Right in your neck.